welcome back to my channel so in today's video is yet again another exciting temu haul it's all about makeup and also like makeup gadgets things like that that is supposed to make our life easier so I am going to get right into this video, but quickly before we begin, if this is your first time watching and you are not subscribed to my channel, make sure you click that subscribe button right now. And also don't forget to click the notification bell so that way YouTube will notify you every time I post a new video. Guys, it is free. The crazy part is that 70% of my viewers are not subscribed to my channel, which is mind blowing. Why not subscribe? I would so appreciate the support. And of course, you guys know that I'm always going to keep bringing you guys Tamu videos. I'm just going to pick as I go because there's like a lot of stuff. First off is this right here. So I believe this is the makeup sponge organizer what is this oh okay yeah i was right uh so this is the makeup sponge organizer or storage so if you're gonna travel this is perfect it's silicone and then it does have like uh air holes so that way it dries and i really like this i actually always wanted something like this and i just think this is perfect i like the nudie color it's kind of like a taupey nude color and it's really nice so i got that really really love it i know i've seen it on amazon a lot of people talk about it but this was only like i think a dollar or two i just know i will have everything linked down below like all the prices and all the links for everything that i'm going to show you so got this right here which is a uh like brush organizer which i thought this was perfect i actually seen laura lee on youtube show this and she actually got it on amazon but i seen it on temu and i was gonna get it on amazon and on amazon i believe it was 12 dollars. this was only like two dollars like you cannot beat that guys you cannot uh, it opens up like this so you can just put like uh, your brushes for on the go and it's easy to clean as well. So I really like that. It's waterproof. So I got that. Can't complain. I like it. That was on my wish list. Really glad I got it. And then I also got this right here. This is a long lasting lip color. It's called Romantic Bear. And um, and I actually really like the ingredients. It has vitamin E, rosehip oils, aloe essentials, natural fruit essence. This is a stain. So basically, you're supposed to apply the tint um, along the lip line. Wait 5 to 10 minutes for the tint pack to dry. And after 5 to 10 minutes, peel it off from the edge. And I'm going to show you guys because I already tried this one on before. So I'm going to show you guys how it actually works. It is pretty amazing. So there are some that I already tried and there's some that I'm going to show you guys right now. But this is how it looks. And this one is uh, called the Romantic Bear Wow Long Lasting lip color it's called sexy red that's the uh shade they do have them in different shades i actually really love this lip color i think this is gorgeous and i highly recommend it it looks like that and then when it comes out it's kind of like a jelly consistency hopefully you guys can see that like a jelly consistency and it smells so divine it smells like uh something that was from my childhood but Oh, it smells so good. I really love it. It truly is like when you first put it on, you're like, whoa, that is red. But once you take off the stain, it is beautiful. And it actually lasts quite a bit. One thing I do recommend is wait about 5-10 minutes as it says. So that way the stain really goes in there. But I like the fact that when I take it off and I peel it off, um, it doesn't feel like I have anything on. It doesn't dry out my lips or anything. I feel like my daughter's going to steal this, to be honest with you. But it's okay. She's all about like lip stains she's like so into it so i feel like this she's gonna go crazy for this is definitely a hit guys i definitely recommend it and the best part is is that it uh it's only like a couple dollars and it comes in like a variety of shades and then moving on to this so i guess this is like a beauty product this is a facial sheet mask holder uh, so it says double the absorption of the mask and i've been wanting this again i wanted to get this on amazon but I mean, now I'm seeing everything that I want at Amazon on Temu, and I'm able to get it for like a couple dollars. This, I don't remember the price, but I know it was probably like, I think it was like a dollar something. It was really cheap. And yeah, I really wanted this because whenever I put my sheet mask on, sometimes it does slide off or it doesn't stay in place. And I like this because you put it behind your ears and it will hold it in and it actually also pushes your uh that moisture in there really nicely so that's the reason why i got this highly recommend it um and it's just a really cool beauty gadget if you're into that 
And then moving on to this cute little uh, like pack of makeup sponges. These are miniature makeup sponges. And then it comes in this little like kind of coffee looking um, organizer or a storage. So this is super cute. So here it is. Looks like that. And it says this is a gift for you. Super fashion. That's what it says on here. You open it up like so, and it does have little breathing uh, holes through it. Uh, does it actually? Yeah, it does. Have little breathing holes through it, so that way you can, I don't know. I mean, I would put them only if they would be dry. But you get tons of them, guys. Let me show you guys, which I am going to put them in that cup. I think the cup is super cute, and I would use one at a time. And when they get old, I will throw them and just, you know, this is a cool little storage. There's one, two, three, four, five, six seven eight nine ten so you get ten of them and i think this was like i don't know i think it was like three dollars i really like these sponges i could tell by the quality of it is really great i do have these small ones and i feel like these are perfect for underneath the eyes this area right here is perfect for underneath the eyes especially here and on your eyelid I'm telling you guys, there's a it does a heck of a difference with your makeup. I do my makeup now differently. I do apply this for my under eye and on my eyelid. And then the regular makeup sponge, I use it for my whole face. But these I highly recommend. These are actually really useful. And they do puff up. They fit all in here. This is so adorable. This is a 10 out of 10. And moving on to this right here, which is a repurchase from uh at first time i bought it was from amazon and i think it was like six dollars for a hundred of them i believe and they can't i bought them all in black yeah i think i bought them all in black and then this time i wanted to get it in kind of like my hair colored i got the darkest brown they have they have a like like a lighter brown and then the dark brown and this came in a pack of 50 for like a dollar really like exactly the same which i like these are very nice because um, they don't damage your uh, hair they don't pull on your hair and they're um, they don't they don't hurt your hair like to me there's a big deal and it actually holds really nicely without giving you a headache so I like these I got a pack of 50 and I decided to get them in the uh, the brown I highly recommend them guys if you're getting us uh, some hair ties I recommend them they're one of my favorite hair ties ever and let's see what else I got where's the makeup I know makeup is somewhere in there but before I show you guys the makeup I actually got this makeup bag right here which I thought was super adorable so it looks like this and I thought I would put like all my makeup uh, whenever I like travel I thought this would be super cute it's like a um like what is it called a tweed it's like this really nice and spacious you can definitely fit a lot of makeup in here it does also have a mesh compartment right here and then also a mesh compartment right here for maybe like your makeup brushes i've been really wanting something like this for on the go and this is really cool very dirt cheap so i thought this was cute they do have them in multiple colors but i do like this this is like black with gold for some reason i thought it was navy but no it's black it's like black and gold moving on to this right here this actually was super excited about and this is called a lying silk warm huh lying silk warm eyeshadow stick that's what it's called this is in the shade 03 golden coral they do have these in different shades here it is this is how it looks this does say that it's a long lasting and it is waterproof so that's interesting but i really like the way it looked on the model so i wanted to try it i like the stick how it's like matte this is how it looks and then you just push it up and here's the color and i just thought the color was actually really really beautiful so this is how it looks really nice and bright right like it's so so pretty so i'm gonna put it on my eye i'm not using a mirror so if it doesn't look perfect don't judge me guys i'm just i forgot to get a mirror and i'm just too lazy to grab it is it going on i don't even know you know what i might have to get a mirror <laughs> hold on actually really like it it's really pretty it has like a nice sparkle but not too much but you can definitely um layer it on really pretty wow this is gorgeous i like it i think i'm gonna get in more colors 
It kind of reminds me of uh, Laura Mercier. I have those sticks. And the only differences I would say is that those are very pigmented. And this one is one of those that when you apply it, it like, it kind of almost like little beautiful pixie glitter on your eye but then if you keep applying it it does really layer up nicely let me see if it applies differently if i use my finger i don't know let me see mm, i feel like with the finger it applies a little bit better for some reason um because i think that it just melts into our hands and it just grabs more perhaps but, ooh, she is pretty. Oh my gosh, I love this. Yeah, I love this. This I'm so happy I got. Let me give you guys a close-up so hopefully you guys can see. I'm definitely thinking of wearing this more often because, wow, I love this. Look at this, guys. It's like a gorgeous, like, pixie color. The girl had, like, a little bit of a, like, she had, like, a coral color in the crease i have more of a brown and it just looks so good so i think i'm gonna do that makeup look how she did it do you guys see that let me close my eyes so you guys can see it is beautiful yeah i love this that is a hit and then moving on to this right here so this is a moisturizing um, it says it's a vitamin E capsules day and night lip oil combination. So basically you got this one, the white one for the daytime and then this is night. I just wanted some lip oils. I'm always intrigued to try more lip oils. This is by the same brand as the eyeshadow stick. So I just wanted to mention that. Let's see if I can open this. Um, but I was very thrilled to try this. I'm going to try the day one on one of my uh on my upper lips and then at the bottom i'm gonna try the night apply with my fingers because honestly i don't want to get this dirty so um this is for the daytime it's really shiny i have to say this is super shiny you know what I, a thought just came through my head that i thought would be really pretty I don't want to put it on because I feel like I already have it. But would that not be pretty if you just put a little bit of this on your lip? Like just a tiny bit. Just a little sparkle. Since it's not like crazy, you can build it up. I feel like that would be perfect. Just a thought, guys. I was just thinking about that and I was like, I think that would be pretty. So this is the night one. Let me see if I could tell a difference in the concentration since it is the day and night. It's a vitamin E oil. So let's see. To be honest with you, they actually feel the same, but they feel really nice and uh, really like moisturizing. I really like this. I feel like this I'm definitely going to use. They're very shiny. This is something you could definitely use as a lip gloss. I mean, it is a tinted, uh, it is a lip oil, so you can use it as a lip gloss if you're just going to have it by itself or kind of top it with whatever color you're wearing. I like this. Last but not least, I got this electric uh, eyelash curler. I wanted to see if it's worth the hype, if it actually works. The first time I tried this, did this, did this did not work. And I honestly feel it's because I was doing it wrong because based on the direction, it says first curl the lashes from um, from the bottom and press the lashes base for like three to, it says three to five seconds. And then you're supposed to brush it and then use it from, and then take the root of the eyelash and curl it and kind of pull that up like this. And I didn't do that. So maybe that's what it is. Now, this does get hot. It doesn't burn your eyelashes, by the way. Just wanted to point that out. And it does come with the USB port so you can recharge it. But I just do, I do want to mention that this does get really nice and hot. You just press this button right here. And then it turns green. Hopefully you guys can see that. It turns green. I, I like I like to wait a few seconds till it gets hot. Like I would say wait like 10 seconds or so. Maybe even like a minute. And then uh, put it on. It's actually really easy to apply. I like this little gadget. But it's a really good little makeup gadget or a makeup hack. Uh, if you want to save time on curling your lashes, this is so good. And it was only like $2. Um, and again, I was going to get this on Amazon. But on Amazon, they are 12 to I think even $20. You cannot beat it. And I really like this gadget. Anything to cut time on doing my makeup, I am here for this. 